On behalf of TD Bank, I'm thrilled to be here today celebrating all award recipients, including this year's Arts, Culture, Education, and Training Award recipient, Michelle Boudin. TD is committed to supporting programs that will help create the conditions where everyone has the chance to succeed. As a workplace, we aim to create these same conditions for our colleagues. One of TD's commitments I'm very passionate about is supporting the advancement of women in areas where they have been traditionally underrepresented and at the senior executive level. When people feel supported and empowered, amazing things happen. The tremendous impact Michelle has had throughout her distinguished career is a testament to this fact. Michelle has become known as a passionate leader committed to advocating for the advancement of women and empowering future leaders. Michelle, thank you for your commitment to your students, your community, and to empowering people to see their true potential. On behalf of TD Bank, I'm honored to congratulate Michelle on this prestigious and well-deserved recognition. Michelle is special. She's devoted over 30 years to higher education, to Fanshawe College, our students, to developing women leaders, and to our community. We have an awareness effort here at Fanshawe College called Here For You. And Michelle brought that to our college. Here For You very much defines Michelle because Michelle is here for students, she's here for young women leaders, she's here for our community. So growing up in a military family probably shaped me more than anything. Um, my father was a, in the military for 32 years, so I grew up on, on bases and, and with other military families. And um, learning, moving and having to change schools and leave friends and so on, you, you learn a lot about uh, resilience and how that change isn't a negative. Sometimes people can fear change, but I've come to see it as a, pos a positive and um, opportunity. It, you can see the possibilities in change. I think the main piece of advice I'd like to give young women is not letting other people set your standards. I have learned early on in my career that I've always set my own standards for myself. I've set the standards high and um, with all due respect to all of my bosses, including my current boss, I have yet to meet a boss who has set a standard higher for me than I've set for myself. And um, what I think is important about that is it's empowering. When you set your own standards for your own performance, it empowers you to set your own goals and uh, to also be really aware of what the importance of your work is. The final piece of advice I'd like to give young women, because I still hear from women today that they believe they have to choose between work and family, especially if they want to go into leadership. Um, I, the balance is there and you don't have to make that choice. I've done that balance my entire career and uh, you can have a future in leadership and have time with your family and your children. Michelle's a wonderful mentor. I've had the opportunity to watch her around our campus mentor young students, mentor faculty and staff, and she does it in such a compassionate, caring way that allows their, in, their inner confidence and passion come forward and sets them up for their career and for their own developmental path guided by Michelle's wisdom. As a young woman, my, my proudest moment, and I, I remember it vividly, was receiving my degree, my first degree at Western. I remember coming off the stage and the dean handed me my diploma, and I hugged it. And I remember thinking, nobody can take this from me. It's it's something I earned, and I worked hard to earn it. And it's I knew then that it was part of my life, and it was going to change my future. And and that was a really important moment in my life. Um, one of my my proudest as a young person. Later in my career, I would say opening library, two new libraries, one at Georgian College, one I worked at Georgian, and here at Fanshawe. We're sitting in the new library, phase one of our new library here, and you can see the Indigenous circle behind me and the library space. And that probably, for me, being able to provide these kind of learning spaces that I consider to be the classroom outside the classroom for students uh, are, the, are proud moments in my life because of the benefit they bring to students. I think one thing I would like to see is more Indigenous um, people involved in decision making, boardrooms, classrooms, um, in general. I, I, it's, I think it's beyond truth and reconciliation and it would be something that I think is really important to our future development um, from a societal point of view and I would uh, hope for that in the future. TD Bank is proud to sponsor the Arts, Culture, Education and Training Award. Congratulations, Michelle. 
On behalf of TD, it is my pleasure to welcome Michelle Boudron.